Coming up next here on most of these YouTube stations is my Burt Bly 11 PC Cards Binder Showcase plus my Gary Carter PC Cards Binder P Showcase. So please stay tuned. Hey YouTube, Mikey here. Welcome to Monday Night Cards. Tonight I'm going to show off Burt Bly Levin and then later on Gary Carter PC Cards Binder Showcase. Alright, I'm going to show off the Flying Dutchman as it's nicknamed Burt Bly Levin. He pitched mostly for the Twins. He did pitch for the Angels. Of course, he also pitched for the Pirates. I don't have him in the Pirates, I don't think. And he also pitched for the Cleveland Indians. He had over 3,700 strikeouts. He did make it to the Hall of Fame. There's the mini right there. There's the career strikeout leaders from 1984, along with Donson and Jerry Kuzman. I think Kuzman should go sometime. All right, there's. Oh yeah, I do have in a Pirates. Him in a Pirates uni. I do have him in the Rangers. I'll get a few more cards of Burt Bly Levin. This is very cheap. Yeah, this is the uh, Diamond Giveaway short print, by the way. And then these two have very the same photos here. I think this is this is from yeah they're both from 1986 Quaker Shoey granola bars okay right after this I will show off the Gary Carter right after this okay we're back onto the Gary Carter PC cards buying the showcase. I'll field a couple of more cards later on this year. Known as the kid, he was 11 time All Star. Primarily a catcher, always a catcher. Played with the Expos. His rookie, I don't have his rookie card, which is that one. Hmm. 
No, that or that one. Actually, is that the rookie card right there? Seventy-five. You played with the Mets in 1986. You did win a World Series with that team. He almost made it to the World Series in, the, in 1981, but lost to my Dodgers in the seventh, another seventh, the fifth game of the NLCS. He later played for the Dodgers and the Giants, and then they came back with the. Montreal Expos and retired there. Now don't tell me how he made it to the Mets Hall of Fame only playing five seasons. Here's the Topps archives right there. This one is also Topps archives down there compared to those two there. There's one in the, in the Giants. I said I'll get I'll get a couple of more cards of them, and then that'll be it. Yeah, it tragically died three years ago in February. It was very shocking, to say the least. Is he with a Mike Schmidt? Oh, I I got another one. <laughs> they all send that card to. Uh, Nate. That's my high end card I have of them right there. Wait, there is two more cards I have to show off. One I pulled out of a blaster. This is from 2010. MCP 29. Beautiful patch there. World Series 1986. That was his World Series victory over the Boston Red Sox. And then last card was sent to me by a YouTuber. I will uh, post it. There it is. Beautiful autograph of Gary Carter. Played with the Mets. Alright. That's it. And that's all. Because. Next week. I'll still do the Monday Night Cards. Which will be. Will Clark. And Matt Williams. So please stay tuned for those. Two binders. This should be very exciting. For you Giants fans. Alright. Happy collecting. And have a great week. Because Earth Day is coming this Wednesday. And help preserve the Earth. By saving lots of water. If you live in the state of California. By his, oops.
that's what I do. Oh, there's Marty. What's your fucker? Max is red sauce. Network.